And now, to think about it, they were working together with this man. But after they began fighting and she knew that he holds her payment, she decided to act all cool. The moment he paid her up her money, that is how and when she turned against him. So now, to look at it, this was part of the plan. And this is a message that I want to talk to you about concerning, you know, like, I mean, similar. And hello everyone, it's Ishmael N, your priest. I welcome you to today's video. Yes, let me say it again. They are planning to kick you out. Some men, you know, when they look at women, when he gets to a woman's life, he acts like he has good intentions and motives, right? Ladies, you can relax, you can relate. After he gets into your pants, he goes to you. Some ladies, after a man spends so much money on her, she goes to him to show that the plan, the plan is, was to get as much money. The plan was to get in her pants and get out. So let me tell you that even at workplaces, those are common stories. Those are common things that people are facing today. You go, you work, you have no idea. You're working so hard. You're giving it your all. I believe in the world today, we can relate. Some people, they'll be like, I was good at my job. No question asked. I was doing this. In fact, they told me that all is okay, but out of nowhere. And funny enough, the person who took over my position, maybe it was a friend. Maybe it was an unqualified type of person. Let me tell you that if you can look back, you can realize that at the end of the day, uh-uh, it was no coincidence. That was part of the plan, to kick you out. Meaning, like the story I gave you in the intro, that lady, at normal circumstances, it's all because when she was acting cool, it could not be a coincidence that they pays her off within a day or so. I just forgot how the story was like, but she dumped him. She came up with stories. But then when you see it from a distance, you get to see that, wait a minute, she sat down all along when she was playing it cool. She was planning to kick him out after she get paid because she could see that if I do this now, hey, oh, this guy might not even give me that money. I have to play it cool. Let me tell you the reality of people that you stay with. They, you can stay with them. You can be working for them. But in the back of their head, all they are doing from that point onwards is an act. Delilah, all along, when it comes to Simpson, she was all along planning to kick him out. So as they were talking, as they were interacting, in the back of her head, she knew that this man, I'm about to let him go. And this man, I'm about to throw him into his enemies. And because she received a bribe. So you see, all this time, as she was, uh, she was asking him questions, what is the secret of your strength? How are you doing all these things? Already, it was a plan. That is why you, it is safe to you to know, for you to know that God knows it all. Let me assure you one thing straight. Had Delilah not known the secret to Samson's strength, he wouldn't have been overpowered. In his case, it was not a matter of God whispering into his ears, Hey Samson, she is lying. Hey Samson, she is to reveal to the enemies. The Lord knew that you, Samson, I don't have to bother myself speaking to you often. As long as you don't reveal this secret, you are sorted. That is why the Lord has given us different gifts. Even unto you, let me tell you that there are some things in your life, they are not the will of the Lord. Meaning if anything, it is not his will there is something you can do about it in order to what? To stop it. Now, heading back to what I said initially, let me tell you that in the case of Samson, if he could keep it a secret, he was sorted. No further instructions. Learn to go with what God is telling you. Some of us, as I'm speaking, 
we have dreams. We see things in dreams. As we wake up, we don't pray against. Some of us, the Lord just tell us to conduct a fast, but we become lazy. Some of us, the Lord does show us with the signs of those close to us that, hey, this person you are regarding as a friend, mm -mm -mm, not to be trusted. And some of us, we are able to sit down and say, yo, but the signs, no wonder, oh, no wonder why this person was always saying this thing, always asking me this thing, because all along, it was part of the plan. My brother, my sister, even at your workplace, even at your business, even at your life as a whole, be it your loved ones, they are being planned against by the wicked one. Already, God Almighty, he knows what is actually happening in the background. That is why I pray, I decree, and I declare any form of plot that is being plotted against you, that is underway, may the Lord rebuke. Did you hear me? May the Lord rebuke. And in Jesus' mighty name, any plot that is to be plotted, that you need to know so that you avoid, so that you don't reveal secrets like Samson, Something to excuse Samson, it was not prayer, but it was for him to keep his mouth shut. I pray, may you keep your mouth shut. May you keep your secret and your method a secret unless you reveal it unto your enemy. May the Lord help you. Wherever they are bad-mouthing you, so that you can get disqualified, you can get disapproved. I pray each and every area, each and every place where things are being done against you, where there are plans that are being plotted, are being planned against you, may the Lord God, I pray, may the Lord God begin to fight for you. May the Lord God send these angels to fight for you in the name of Jesus Christ. And lastly, I pray, whatever hurts your loved ones, it also hurts you. Therefore, I pray for them as well. Wherever they are plotting against any of your loved ones, those closer to your heart, your children, your family, your siblings, whoever is attached to you, who is under a plotting of the wicked one, of enemies, your prayers as you agree together with me in faith. May they also be protected. I pray in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And of course, remember, you can book an appointment with me. My details are on the comment section below. See you next time.